Why can't Germans just say something nice and leave it there? And just leave it there. <laughs> no, it's you impossible. Know? There's always so like, it's like, or they, you come in and they're like, oh, today your hair is very nice. <laughs> Meaning like, oh, yesterday it wasn't. Personal questions. I pick those to you ask pick you. pick those to ask me. And the white ones are me asking you. You have the nicer color. I'm a little oh. jealous. <laughs> and these questions are general questions. For the both of us. There will be joker questions. So I can make up my own question and ask you whatever. You understand? Yeah, yeah I got it. <laughs> Let's start it. What is the most extravagant item on your rider? And which item could you most likely do without? I'm, I'm letting everybody in on a little secret here. That shit on the rider, you pay for it. So whenever somebody's like, oh, Madonna demanded like a pink room full of flowers and whatever it is, whatever, if she paid for it herself, like let Madonna do Madonna, you know? So our rider is all sheep shit. The most extravagant thing because you'd like to have your money on your bank account. <laughs> well, no, because it's like the, mo the most extravagant thing w was something we tried to do, but it felt too weird. Because like, being on tour is a very like male environment. Like most of the people on our crew, it's like there's like one girl and then right. it's like all guys kind of. And it was getting so tiring that our drummer had this idea like, what, what I really would like on the rider is like a, a friendly, well-educated girl to have a conversation with. <laughs> oh my room. God. <laughs> That's pretty extravagant. I love that. That's so funny. And then what could I do without? There's like been a salami on our rider for like 25 years and no one has touched it. Yeah. So we should like just scratch that out. What was the most significant twist in your life and what happened? I guess when I moved to America, I think, yeah, it was a big twist. Like, that changed everything. I would always do it again. I think uh, it was time. My brother and I were 20 years old and we were tired of, um, I guess, our career and the music and we've been doing this for so long. So we needed to like get away and step away from it to fall in love with music and fall in love with our own career again. Is it my turn? Yep. Yep. <clears throat> Oh, this is a joker question. Mm. What do you think of German people? How do you like the Germans? And be honest. Yeah, I'm gonna be Are honest. Are they a little annoying and uptight and like, you know? But you're, that's a leading question then. No, <laughs> no, what I think is this. There's like a thing, I love German people and I love German crowds are fucking great. Yeah. Amazing. There is one thing though, it's like what we call the German compliment, which has to start with something that's the opposite of a compliment. Uh -huh. And I think it's because you want to seem like you're smart. So there's always like that thing where you're like, I don't like your new record, uh -huh. but I love the last record. Yeah. And then you come back like two years later and they're like, I love your last record, but I don't like the new one. I'm yes. like, well, you didn't like that. It's the same person. Like, what do you... And there's always like people coming in the dressing room, like giving you a compliment, but also kind of dissing you. Yeah. And it's kind, of, it's, like, it's kind of just, I know you're trying to be like not, you want to keep on the same level or something. I can't believe you're But you you're don't saying. really, it does, it's not, it's rude. Kind of. I can't believe you're saying this because I said the same exact thing just a few days ago to my brother. Isn't and, it weird? And I was like, why can't Germans just say something nice? And without, leave it there. And just leave it there. <laughs> no, it's you impossible. Know? There's always it's like, always like, or they, you come in and they're like, oh, today your hair is very nice. <laughs> Meaning like, oh, yesterday it wasn't, you know? Yeah, There's yeah. always this little it's hint like of- It's like a little e Exactly. But I think it's because otherwise you like, you're like, you're like, too subservient or yeah, something? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or it's like that you don't, you want your compliment to sound smart. Yeah. So you have to say something bad. Exactly, too. yeah. So you'll always be like, yeah, I know, the, you played too fast today, but the for new songs are good. Like, but I don't know. Yeah, yeah you exactly. I guess that's it for me and Bill. Yeah. Stay tuned for more Tombola interviews with the Anchor Awards jury.